Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a great day as always. Today we got something a little bit different going on. Um, as a BMW owner, I'm ordering parts for it kind of often, mostly for preventative maintenance. But I use a website called FCP Euro and they offer lifetime warranty replacements on pretty much everything you order from the website. So that, what that means is oil, wiper blades, really any part that has a lifespan you can you buy it once and then the next time you buy it you can ship back the old wipers or the old oil for your money back and uh, i've done this once so far this uh this year because i kind of just learned about it and then did an oil change recently so anyway uh, i'm going to show you kind of a few steps how to do it it's pretty simple so the first thing you're gonna have to do is you're gonna need a PayPal account and you're gonna use PayPal to pay on FCP Euro every time you order something. So make sure you have PayPal set up. Make sure that you actually like, there's a free return thing that you like activate. So you're gonna go ahead and we're on PayPal right here. Um, you see in the recent activity, we're gonna go to show all now, one big discrepancy. When you order something from FCP, you get 150 days. Well, actually, it's not that you're ordering from FCP, but it's the fact that you're paying with PayPal. So when you use that, when you use PayPal, you get 150 days to actually set up your free return label. So let's see, we're gonna go to July, 2021. And you're going to scroll down, you're going to see right, nope, you're not going to see it there. Let's do this one, August 23rd. Here we go. So you're going to see, get return shipping on us. And then you kind of just do, so here, you can do create a free FedEx shipping label, or you can request a shipping refund. I went with the FedEx shipping label because there was a drop off near me and it was pretty simple to set up. You just have to print. So once you've uh, done the PayPal setup, I think it wants to ask, if I remember correctly, I think it asks for an order ID or an order number. So now I'm on FCP, make sure that you are logged in um, to your account. You're gonna need an account, I believe. I'm just closing these because so here we go. Here's all the order numbers you can see on the left. And I think I had one set up. I was gonna do my girlfriend's oil, but hers was over 150 days, so I won't be able to do that. Um, but here you're gonna see the reason, and you can select whatever you're turning. Um, and then once you get further along let's see we're just going to click this you can do warranty i usually do lifetime replacement then you got the return order number so you can see the return order is this is the order number for your new replacement parts you must first purchase new replacement parts before submitting a warranty return so if you're going to do this oil change kit even though i can't this is the first time i I uh, bought it, so then the second time purchasing it, then that's when you put the second return. So basically, you're not returning this first one, you're going to return the second one, if that makes any sense. Um, I just off camera made sure I wasn't forgetting anything. It's really pretty simple. I mean, once you do it the first time, you're going to be like, oh wow, that's pretty easy. Uh, make sure you have your VIN for your vehicle, and I think that's it. I'm going to go ahead and edit this real quick and put it up on the internet. I'll see you guys later. 